Hey everybody, Ann here. I'm outside. This is my routine, first thing in the morning, before I even put the coffee on. At first I started with this size bucket. And after I was feeding the rabbits three full ones of these alone a day, I figured it's time to move on up. There you go, beautiful babies. I could have filled it up a little bit more, but I think that's enough for now. My hands are freezing off. So time to go feed the bunnies. Come on out, babies. Good morning. Now you look at that. It is about 7 a.m. right now. By noon, this whole pile will be gone. They're chow hounds. Come on out, my babies. I'll forage for them later. They're just going to get chicken feed this morning. I did uh, scatter some sardines around. Oh, oh. <laughs> Mr. Romeo wants to get a girl. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, all seven are out. Just got to go check on Beauty. There she is. She hops up in there. Uh, I'm going to leave her food right down here. I put a little piece of <laughs> sardine in it so she'll get out. Uh, she's been laying me an egg a day up in that little box. But she's still not putting any weight on that leg, which is probably a good thing, so we're going to give her a little bit longer. Now I can make my coffee. Can't see that. It's dark. Thank goodness. Yep, just to pour over. One scoop of chocolate protein powder. And you know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking I need to make this extra special. Peanut butter! Ha 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 ha. Sorry about the lights. Oh, this is going to be delicious. This tastes so good, you guys. Oh, it's delicious. Well, it's starting to get a little bit lighter, so that's good. Today, well, I have got to go to Tractor Supply Company to pick up some supplies. I need dog food, chicken feed, chicken scratch, chicken bedding, um, and who knows what else. But I'm going to take my boy Papa with me. This boy's so excited. He knows he's going for a ride in the truck. Let's see how the rabbits are doing two hours later. Oh my gosh, they've eaten quite a bit of it. They are just pigs. Look at this boy. <laughs> He's so happy to be with me. Mwah. In the truck. Love you, Papa. I'm back from Tractor Supply, and believe me, this whole thing did not go without drama. Okay, here's what happened. Uh, the gift certificates that I had sent to me, I put them in my tractor supply account um, as a digital gift certificate. Because a, a lot of times I'll just order online for curbside pickup. Well, um, a lot of the stuff wasn't available for a curbside pickup for whatever reason. And I think it's because I went there before and, um, you know, they've had some change in employees and... Um, the person doing their inventory isn't updating properly, so not everything is going to be shown as in the store. So you can't mark it for curbside pickup. Anyhow, so I get up to the register. I got all this stuff that I'm buying that I needed. And um, they, the store didn't recognize that I had all this money in my, uh, in my account as a gift certificate. So I pulled up on my phone and my phone is going dead okay it's about ready to go dead and so I'm trying to show them look it's right here and they they didn't show it them in their system so um, well what that means is once you convert it to a digital gift card it'll be in your tractor supply account but the stores won't be able to utilize it they don't it um, their website does not communicate with their stores so if you ever get tractor supply company physical Gift cards, don't convert them into digital unless you're going to order online and go pick it up or have it delivered. <sighs> so what should have taken me mm, 30 minutes ended up taking two and a half hours. It was awful. You know, we had a little, a little you know, heated uh, situation going on there, but um, it was resolved, and I ended up resolving it myself. Um, as soon as I recognized the problem, I said, you know what, I'll just let me go out to my truck and plug in my phone because it was down to like four percent and that's not good um and i just uh was able to do the the online order for curbside pickup 
and um, unfortunately the online price for the chicken feed was like a couple bucks more but I was just like so done so here's what I got I got 50 pounds of chicken feed I got 50 pounds of dog food I got 50 pounds of chicken scratch I got uh, flea and tick medicine for Papa I got oh check this out I got me a new pair of mud boots because my others were like leaking from underneath there was a crack in them or something and so I got these these are actually men's and because they're cheaper than the women's and I didn't need any like frilly flowers on them or anything I just need a pair of boots and uh, I got them a little bit bigger than I actually needed just because I have so much trouble slipping this leg <laughs> into mud boots because of the knuckle over that foot always hurts but they're great and uh, I definitely needed them and I got a pair of very sharp garden loppers they're gonna be multi-purpose oh and uh, when I got home because I still had a balance and you know I mean I was just so frazzled by the time I didn't um, end up getting these things while I was in the store um, I ordered online for delivery and I get a free delivery once per quarter and it's a new quarter so um, I ordered five big bags of uh, pine shavings and I ordered I think it was five or six seven foot tea posts so they're not going to be delivered today because I put the order in too late um, so they'll deliver them sometime tomorrow and that is it um, you know tractor supply company they got a lot of good stuff there but I'm going to start looking into the local co-op as far as chicken feed, maybe even dog food, um, because their prices are just a little expensive and they don't always have the exact chicken feed that I want. Today, I mean, I went in there and it, it was bare. Um, so I had to pay a little bit more to get a different kind, but that's okay. The chickens will do fine on it. Um, the last time, in fact, uh, a few weeks ago, I went in to get the, the kind of chicken feed that I want that is like four, four or five dollars cheaper, and they didn't even have it then. So, um, I think I might start supporting my local co-op. I'm just going to go in there, you know, and I hate going to the new places <laughs> that I'm not familiar with. But I'm going to go in there and check it out and see what they got and see what their prices are like and see if it's any better. Um, because, I don't know, I've had a couple times going into a tractor supply company and um, a couple employees have kind of had a little attitude with me and uh, I don't like that, you know. Um, <laughs> I don't like it at all. Today I was, a, I was a little bit off the hook, you know. I'm like, oh my gosh. But uh, it ended well. It ended well anyhow, so... Oh no, it's kind of late in the day now to get anything else started. Eh, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.